I just don't know anymore, Joe. Maybe I should just throw in the towel. Sounds good to me. Are you even listening anymore? You're right again, my friend. Ugh. What the hell? Rock! You can't give up! The future depends on you! Oh my god. What are you talking about? Wait, you're on Paul. What are you doing here? If you don't win the 2012 election, the world you know will be gone! You must come with me, now! Come with you where? Back to the future. The future? What happens to us in the future, Ron? It's not you, Brock. It's your opponents. Something's gotta be done about your opponents. It all started at Republican National Headquarters. Ha <laughs> ha! I smell an expositional flashback coming up. My fellow Republicans, our days of losing elections to people like Barack Obama are over. Thanks to a generous donation by our richest member, Donald Trump. It's gonna be huge, and you're fired. Former President George W. Bush. I'm playing hide and seek. Don't tell Cheney you saw me. <laughs> and our main correspondent, Sarah Palin. Hooray! I'm adorable, eh? Who is always here, but never seems to do anything important. I hunt moose for fun. Okay, that's enough, Sarah. I'm from Alaska. I have invented and perfected the first cybernetic politician. Wait, you've built a Republican cyborg? Precisely. This invention is half machine, half conservative. His mind is programmed to the right. He will not eat. He will not sleep. He will not stop until the goals of Republicans everywhere are accomplished. Everyone, I present the Romney 1000. Hi. My name is Mitt, and I'm running for president. <laughs> oh, jolly gosh, gee. He's just like an actual Republican. Anyone want to buy some discount pizza? Here it is, gentlemen, the future of the Republican Party. <laughs> um, guys. What is it now, Ron? Shouldn't we be concerned that these cyborgs might become self-aware and revolt against us? Don't be ridiculous. He's a Republican robot. And if we know one thing about Republicans, is that they don't start wars. Low tax rates for the 1%, free wars, unlimited spending. Cannot raise taxes, dogs do not ride in cars. Oh my god, who is white born in Kansas and only supports America? What's happening? The Romney 1000 seems to be malfunctioning. Romney, power off! No power off. No compromises. Attack! The Republicans have become self-aware! Run for your lives! Oh my god! Ah! I'm Mitt Romney, and I approve this destruction. My god, Mitt Romney is a robot. Of course, it all makes sense now. I knew he was too handsome to be human. Wait, where am I in the future? The machines deported you to your native country of Nigeria. Those bastards. Wait, why don't we just tell people the truth? You fool, Americans hate the truth. Rational thought, simple conclusions, productive problem solving, these are all enemies of the American people. I am also part of this conversation. You're right, Ron. Then what do we do? There's only one way. Yahoo! Roads? Where we're going, we don't need roads. And you know, that really does help our balance that little budget deficit problem we're having. You might as well give up. You can't win, Obama. Yes, we can. Isn't that right, Joe? Yay, I'm useful. You sure are, champ. And respected. Let's not get carried away. Yeah! Republicans, Republicans assemble! assemble. Democrats, forward. I'll see you in November. You better bring your birth certificate, because I'll make you wish you were never born. Consider it brought. I'll bring it like rich white people bring their influence into politics. So who are you voting for, man? The black guy or the Mormon? Yeah, I don't care. Besides, I'm gonna be busy watching the New Jersey Shore spin-offs and playing Halo 4. 
Yeah! Who has time to vote with all the needless distractions we have to enjoy? You said it, friend! If I make you head of the EPA, will you tell me I matter? I wrote a book!